Hi, and I thought it was about time um, that I actually got round to showing you how to use the free capture page generator that Jim Yagi put together for you. And if you remember, Jim is one of our um, insiders. He actually contributed to the insider report. Now, I know that it, you know I told you all about this back in April, um, but I just haven't got round to doing the video that actually shows you how simple it is. So we're going to put that to rights right now. So if we head on over um, to the, the generator site, and there's the URL, you can see that it's jimyagi.com forward slash capture underscore generator. And this is where you end up at the, the capture page editor. Now if we scroll down, you can see that you know there's half a dozen different styles there. You can click on you know any one of them to get a preview of what it looks like. Okay. Um, I've just elected to go with number one just to show you what this is and how easy it is to use. Um, and Jim does say you can get some prettier templates. Um, I'll have to chase them up about that. Um, now you've got all of the boxes here. You can see that I've already filled them in. That's just to save a little bit of time on the video. So you put your pre-header text in, your main headline text, your subheading, your offer. Um, if you're not sure what these are, don't worry about it because Jim tells you exactly what needs to go into each box. So you just put them all in there um, and then you would scroll right down to the bottom. Um, your autoresponder code is obviously the most important. Do make sure that you put that in there and that ensures that once um, someone's inputted their details, they then go into your autoresponder. Okay. At the moment, um, it does say eye contact, but I'm sure that Jim was updating it to include other autoresponders. So I'll, I'll need to get in touch with Jim. I still haven't done that. Apologies. And once you've, you know, you filled it in, it takes you about five minutes. You then just click on give me the code. If you want to preview it, which you know I would suggest you do, you want to check that it, you've got everything in there. Then click open with as opposed to save. So you would open it with whichever browser that you use and I'm using um, Firefox and that's it there it is as simple as that you've got all of your information in there if you know it doesn't look exactly how you want it to look go back over make some uh, changes and preview it again until you get it exactly right and that's how easy it is so head on over um, it is to as I say jimyagi.com forward slash capture underscore generator and, and go create some capture pages. Have fun.